Question 21. Felicity asked 100 students how they came to school one day. Each student walked or came by bicycle or came by car. 49 of the students are girls, 10 of the girls came by car, 16 boys walked, 21 of 41 students who came by bicycle are boys. This is a lot of information. Um, I think it might be a good idea to start putting down what we know into a table. Um, we, so we know there are boys and girls. It's the only option. It's boy or girl. And we're told the only three travel options that they've got are walk, bicycle, or car. I mean, if these are the only options, the table just helps us to organise all of our calculations. It doesn't have to be massively neat, but a pencil and a ruler will at least give us straight lines to deal with. So what facts do we know? 49 of the 100 students are girls. So we know that this has got to add up to 49. We know that there are 100 students in total. So that means there's got to be 51 boys. At this stage, it might be a good idea if we put on a final row and column for totals just to make sure that all our numbers add up so that's total and this one's total what the facts do we know 10 of the girls came by car so out of the girls 10 came by car. 16 boys walked. 21 of the 41 students who came by bicycle, so 41 students came by bicycle is what it says. There are 41 students who came by bicycle. 21 of them are boys. Okay, so that's the information that we know. I'm just going to change into writing in blue here so you can see the stuff that we're going to work out. We want to know the number of students who walked to school. So we need to know how many girls walked. Well, we can use this information about the bicycles to work out how many girls uh, came by bicycle because it has to add up to 41. If 21 boys it means there are 20 girls came by bicycle. So now if we look at all of the girls, we've already accounted for 30 of them. So out of the 49 total, we've got 19 left over and they must have walked. So if 16 boys walked and 19 girls walked, add those two together with a total of 35 have walked. And that's your final answer, 35. We could work out the rest of the missing values, but we don't need to because the question just asked for those who walked.